I remember when I first heard about Lacey Peterson, an expectant mother going missing. The facts surrounding the story made it so much more poignant. It was Christmas time. She was just about to give birth. The delivery of her son, her, son, her unborn son, Connor, was imminent. Connor would be her first child, a baby boy, and she and her family, I guess, were living out the happiest time of their life when she went missing. Many people thought that Scott Peterson was handsome, attractive. Attractive good-looking, smart, college degree, job, car, golfer, his whole family worshipped him. He had everything, right? Beautiful wife, home, baby on the way. The facts didn't seem to gel together for me the way that Scott Peterson delivered them. There was something in his demeanor uh, when he did not publicly beg for her return. I think I was stunned. I kept watching Scott Peterson in his various statements. He would never give a public plea to find Lacey, but I would watch him walking here and there. And I also remember during one interview in his home, his phone kept ringing. Now, if my spouse or child was missing, I would be living on top of the phone, hoping somebody would call me. He didn't even go pick it up. He let the answer machine get it. I have learned the hard way that murderers come in all shapes and sizes and colors and with all sorts of college degrees and or not and that all that matters, just the facts, that's all that matters. I recall just an overwhelming sadness when I heard that baby Connor's body had been found. I mean, we all knew Lacey was dead, but just the finality of the baby's body coming ashore and at first being mistaken for a baby doll. It's very, very hard to even think back on it. I saw it through the eyes, I guess, of Sharon Rocha, her mother, and just the devastation this heinous act wreaked on Sharon and her husband and their family. guilty verdict came down. I walked out of the courtroom and people were cheering. People were cheering. It was as if, as if Lacey were everybody's sister. That was the connection so many people had with Lacey Peterson.